you know, we need to get some education out there about bees. Bees aren't all about getting stung, certainly. Um, you know, bees do that as a defense mechanism, same as a dog would bite or a snake would bite or a cat or anything else. So it's not that they just are out to sting you. That's a defense mechanism to protect their territory. We have certainly a decline in bees and pollinators in general. And I think everyone, certainly me, but a lot of people are interested in how to curtail that decline. The importance of pollination for the food that we eat Whereas, you know, one third of every bite of food that we take in is the pollination is provided by some pollinator, primarily honeybees nowadays. Yeah. Bees aren't like they were when our grandparents or great grandparents were around. Everybody back then had a hive of bees in the yard, and that was just, you know, they bring in some honey once a year, but they didn't really have to tend to them at all. They could halfway forget about them for once a year. But bees nowadays are more like livestock or even not, not necessarily pets, but to that degree that they require a lot more management a lot more often and they require inputs and, and just checking on them on a very regular basis because they can go into decline pretty quickly or they can overcompensate and swarm. And so there's a lot more management involved in keeping bees today than it was 30 or 50 years ago. And then with the, the pest and the problems that we have, it, it's really it's stressful on them all the time. So. It's a, it's a lot more than just sticking them out there and watching them.